Hey, suckers. How y'all doing? I miss y'all. I know I made a video. Well, I made two videos today. One was real small and one was just my quick outfit of the day. And, um, I got to go on a diet, y'all. Oh, my goodness. I looked at that video and my little stomach pouch in the front. No, I keep wondering why I'm so hot. Shoot. I had that thing tied around my head. See, my edge is coming out from under my wig. Come on, thing. Hold on. Pull that bad boy down, honey. I have not taken this wig off since I since I did it. But it's really, really loose now. So I could take it off and um wash and condition my hair and gel it back up. So I'll do that probably before the fourth of July. So we'll see how that go. But anyway, y'all, I, I didn't want nothing. I was just coming to shoot the breeze, just run my mouth. So this might be a long video, and some might watch it and some might not. But I just want to say thank you in advance to everybody that do. Um, Just kind of give y'all an update with me. I'm doing okay. Um, I've been in the way, and my husband say I've been gone a lot lately. Seem like every time he put money in my hand, I'm in the store. And he ain't told no lie. And I know it really would be a problem, y'all, if I was an online shopper. Oh, my goodness. But me, I, I like to go out and just look. I don't even have to shop. Sometimes I just go just to get ideas and just, I don't know. It's just something about it. And um, I got the DIY bug this week. So, um... I've been looking around my house for some other things to do, something to create. And I'm going to get it together. I'm going to find something. I got to find, um, I'm going to go back to Dollar Tree and get some of those square plates. But I got to find the right kind of spray paint to use on them. Um, I'm going to go to some of the Goodwill and thrift stores and find some old, like, ceramic cookie jars and things like that and I want to spray paint them in some primary colors um, put like some dots and some scrolls and things like that on I want to do it myself I don't want to buy them already done because um, yeah they can get pricey and if I can pay $7.99 for a little small cookie jar I can buy a plain one and decorate it myself you know and then have the extra paints left over so it's going to take me some time to get the kitchen the way that I want it. Um, I'm impatient in that area because when I do something, I like to be able to find it. But because I don't have a theme and I'm just doing colors, but I kind of have an idea of how I want it. I don't have an idea of how I want it to look. It'll just come to me and it'll be, it's like, that's how I do some things. It's like I have an idea about bits and pieces, but not an overall, you know, picture. And when it's done, I'll know it. It'll be like, okay, that's it. So I was pretty happy with the way things came out last night. I just got to fill it in in some different spots and add some different things. It's like, um, if you want to give it a theme, it's kind of like summer vacation, summer picnic. You know, um, really tropical and festive and bright, bold colors. I love that. Certain times of year, I get to where I'm a more earth tone person, real calm. Um, the summer, get kind of hot in the ass, if you want to say it like that. Um, fast, flirty, party mode. But I do know when to stay in the house. When it get too hot, uh-uh. No, mm-mm. Black draw heat, mm-mm. So that's what that's what that with the kitchen. I have not decorated my bathrooms yet. And 
Every time I get ready to do it, I find something else to do in another part of the house. So, um, I did get some pictures from Dollar Tree. Um, so, that'll be my theme. So, I gotta find, I don't know what color shower curtain I want, but I want, I love red. I love red. I love a lot of colors, but red just does something to me. It's just... Y'all see that red on? Well, y'all, it's not bright to y'all, but it's a really, really bright candy apple red, you know. Let's see. Can you see that red up on that flower up there? And that word kiss? Yeah, that kind of red. I want a shower curtain that color or either a really, really dark black. I mean, midnight black. Um, and I want to mix um, a camel color, red, black and silver together for my bathroom so I'm gonna be traveling um, it'll probably be probably I'm not gonna do I'm not sure what I'm gonna do in July as far as shopping because I gotta get ready for okay we having something 4th of July um, and then uh, excuse me. I gotta get ready for Mia's birthday. Is the end of July, and then start school shopping, cause school will be in in August. I'm not sure. I think it's August twenty something. I believe it is, unless they change it, cause they always changing the date here. So we will see how that goes. So I know the bathroom is it's not a must at the moment, but I know eventually. Within the next few months, I'll get that taken care of. Um, I got to scrub down the outside of my house. I have big, big trees on the outside. And it's just green. It's not mold. I don't know what it is. Fungus on the outside of my siding. And I've been so lazy. I mean, I could have did it today, y'all. But when it's hot outside like that, I don't know, dog. I mean, I ain't, I'm not going to say I can't do it. I was like, mm-mm. I thought about it. I hated to get out of the car. Um, going from inside Walmart and having to walk inside the store. That was hot. I mean, it was hot, suffocating heat. Like, whoo. And it was only 97 degrees. But it's a dry heat. And man, oh man. <sighs> so, um,. Yeah, I just got a few things on my plate that I desperately need to do. I need to get my carpet shampooed. Yeah. It's not hideous, but I can look at it and see little things. That um, But I got this carpet cleaner. I don't have it in here. It comes in a little bottle. Any little spots on the carpet, you can pour it on there and you get a white rag and just rub. And it will come clean. So I need to really spot clean it. Because it's not that bad. And just vacuum. Um, as I do. I want to go and buy me another vacuum. Even though I have one. That's just a me. I don't know. My husband would say I'm never satisfied. And he could be right. I have it for a while. And then I want something different. I don't know. That's just me. That's just me. You know, when you're a woman and you have your own job and making your own money, you can do that. You ain't got to be satisfied with what somebody give you. And so that's just been me. I'm just just like that. Um, I went to Walmart today after I left Dollar Tree and I picked up two tank tops. This one is a hot pink. Hold on. I'm going to go in the bathroom. Maybe y'all can see it better. <clears throat> this one is a kind of tan cream color. Let's see. Which way is the best light? Right there. And this is a hot pink. So I got two of those. And that's to go with the shorts that I bought from Old Navy. Did y'all hear me say Old Navy? <laughs> Old Navy. <laughs> Old laser mouth heifer. Yeah, there. Get it together, Risa. Shoot. 
so picked up those tank tops um I know what my problem is. Mm-hmm. But anyway, hold on a minute, y'all. Hold on. I'm right here with you. I got this red dye on my hands from those water beads last night. Water does about it good, y'all. And I keep one by my bed, one or two. I, I just went through a 12 pack since. Okay, what's the day? Saturday, I bought one Monday. No, it was a 24 pack. So I got to go get me another one tomorrow. Just, that's my last one. And I like them room temperature. But, um, so I bought those two tank tops. I got the flip-flops. Today at Old Navy, they had, um, one dollar flip-flops up until 12 noon. I didn't even go back, y'all. I was like, mm-mm. I bought two pair. I was upset because I was like, I bought two pair. I could have got five. But then I think about the ones that I got from Dollar Tree. And I've heard a lot of people say the ones at Dollar Tree, they pop easy. But what I'm going to do. That liquid glue that I bought, I will take it, you know, where the little knob piece on the bottom, I'm going to glue it to the bottom of the shoe. And if it pop any other kind of way, then it was meant to pop, okay? So, because um, I know I bought some dollar flip-flops and you know how the little thing come out the hole real easy. I'm going to glue it. And then I bought the little insoles, the little cushions for your heel to go on the shoes so I'm gonna make it work for me and I've got some rhinestones that's another DIY project I can do hot dog god darn it I'm gonna do that too I might not do it tonight I might do it tomorrow but I've been home all day and it didn't even dawn on me man I could have knocked them flip flops out but y'all I want me some red white and blue the American flag leggings um, who was that? Was it Rue 21 or either Charlotte Ruth yesterday had a pair and they had them in a large. I could get them up to my thighs. I could get them on. But you know how. I didn't want them squeezing me like that. I don't want it to where you can see through it. You know, you know, you've been on stretch the fabric so thin that you can see through it. I didn't want it like that. I wanted to hold me in, but I don't want it to hold me in to where I. I'm look like the fabric about to just melt away, you know. It was twelve ninety nine. I want me some of those. I don't know where else to get them from. Oh, I want me some of those. I wanted it for the Fourth of July, but um, I think I'm gonna settle for going to get me a red, white, and blue um, tank top, or either just get me a. Um, I want a high low tank top. And, um, I want to layer them. Uh, I got some blue, I already have some blue leggings. So I can use the blue leggings and do a red and white tank. Good to go. I'll do that. And I can do silver and red accessories. Um, and I'm going to have to do something with my toes. I'm going to try white. White don't go on so neat. I just don't. I don't know. But I'm going to try white and might put some like red and blue dots on them. And see how that go. I'm going to try something. As long as my baby like it. And he saw them pants. He was like, hell yeah. You need to get those. And I was like, you don't think it's going to be too much? I don't. I like leggings, but I don't want to be flamboyant you know just I don't know I can't even explain it I want it to be tasteful 
I don't want to look funky. Do you get what I'm saying? <sighs> so, I mean, with my baby's approval, he was like, hell yeah, get them. Shit. Uh, how much they cost? Okay, go on. he told me, go on in there and see if they got them. Because the mannequin had them on and she had on a white tank with silver accessories. And he was like, and I know everything you see on the mannequin don't look good on everybody's body. But he was like, baby, I, I'm looking at you and I'm telling you, them pants going to look nice. And he told me to get the large. And I was like, no, my hips are not a large. I have, um, my hips are 42. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And my waist is um thirty-six inch waist, thirty-six inch waist, forty two inch hips, and my my bra size is thirty eight. Thirty eight D. This lady told me I wear a thirty eight double D. I went to this lingerie shop. And, you know, they carry all types of bras and panties and all that old good stuff. And they measure you and all. She told me I wore a 38 double D. And I was like, oh, hell, where I get them kind of titties from? You know, so I didn't pay her any attention. I bought a 38 D. And it's kind of snug around the rib cage. But it, and I, I think it's because of the type of bra that I had because it is a push-up bra. So I don't know. I've been that's what I've been buying and then I went and bought a 40d and it's too big around the rib cage so I guess I am a 38d and um so it's 38 36 42 I know that's jacked up but <laughs> yeah uh and I'm four foot eleven and I still cannot believe I wore size 12 shorts. Those shorts I had on the day were a size 12. And they were so big in the waist, I had to wear a belt. And um, I didn't have to struggle to put them on or anything. And I was really, really happy about that. Because of the way I'm built, it's not easy to get shorts. Um, unless they stretch really, really. And these have stretch. They have give in them. So... Like a lot of jean shorts, I don't buy because if they don't give, I can't wear them because I need them to to fit a certain kind of way. So, I went through that. Um, my girls are getting ready for college. And my son, um, Janae did a video today. I told I said, Janae, do a hair video, a tutorial showing how you do your hair. And upload it to my YouTube page. Just to see if you like it. See if you like doing it. And um, so she did it. And she just, <laughs> she was like, this is the way I like my hair. I don't care if you guys like it or not. You know, teenagers. Corey is up there going off. He misses his dad and his brother. He do. Because they've been gone all day and yesterday. And they played with him a little while yesterday. But being home with us ladies. See, he liked to wrestle and tussle and jump off stuff. And bush in the head with stuff. And put on the boxing gloves. And Mama is... I've never been um, rough and tough like that. I just don't. I didn't like playing tennis, volleyball, basketball. I used to do flag football a little bit, but didn't do that too much till they wanted to knock you over and stuff like that. Mm -mm. Um, so I made a C in gym. If it wasn't for the work that you had to do with it, I would have failed because I didn't like to dress out. I don't like to sweat. I didn't. Mm -mm. So I, mm, I was never that. I guess I am prissy in that in that way, but so. We, I don't know. He just, he do, he is rough. He is all boy. He really is. He is all boy. And I'm not used to that because Darian was so quiet. And he still is quiet. But Corey, he loud, active. Y'all don't know, 
I don't buy scrub to paint off the wall in my little girl's room because that dude will take a crayon and just girl he just do his masterpiece everywhere. Thank you, Lord, for coming. Thank you, Lord, for coming. So I had a man to come out and give me an estimate on painting the room. Because I don't I want it done professionally. I want it done right. I can paint, but my hand-eye coordination as far as straight lines is not good. And I want the bottom half of the wall to be black jet black and um the top half I'm gonna leave white and I think um yeah so that's what I'm gonna do in, the, in my girls room and um we're going to go from there. Because I'm tired of old dude drawing all on the wall and stuff like that. And they say, do the washable washable markers. Ashley got both phones. I hope she answered. That's my baby calling. But anyway, y'all. Like I say, I just came to want to chit chat. I wrote, I found, um, he must have smelled the camera. What's in your mouth? Quit that. Swallow that water, boy. Kimmy Key, my mother shows it. I'm my mama joke. And then I eat be sorry. I hope it's have a cake and he well no. It's okay. Get get real You a You done? You done? <laughs> Are you finished talking now? I finished talking now. Tape recorder. Don't you peel my words off that wall. Get out, rusty bucket. Get out. Take a bugle. That says always. Uh, always. Kiss. Kiss. Me. Me. Good night. Good night. So that means you got to kiss mommy good night. Good night. You're not going to kiss mommy good night? Uh, good night. Give mommy a kiss. <coughs> Give me a kiss. Mm -hmm. Thank you. <laughs> that says kiss. A kiss. B. K. I. S. S. I'm mama. Good night. No, that don't say good night. That says kiss. That says good night. A good night. Mhm. Mm you gotta go to sleep when you say good night. Good night. Yeah. He's supposed to be going to sleep. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta go to sleep. Go to sleep. Close your eyes. Close your eyes. And go to sleep. <laughs> Y'all know what? Good morning. Good morning. How are you? How are you? I'm so glad to see you. I got to see you. Are you okay? You okay? Great job. Great job. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. Anything else? Thank you. <laughs> you gonna mock me. <laughs> I 
I got to give my boy, my husband, to cuss me out because I won't cut my boy hair. Shoot, I don't be feeling like sleep. struggling with him. Sleep. You got to go sleep. <sighs> He gonna go to sleep. He gonna lay down and go to sleep now. You gotta close your eyes. Oh, that's too much light right here. He close his scared to go go to sleep. I got it. I got it. You got it. I got it. <laughs> there, your daddy calling. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, daddy's calling. Oh, Go answer God. the phone, Corey. Go get the phone from Ashley. Close the door. Circle wouldn't even close the door. Close the door. Thank you. Anyway, y'all. I found some of um some names in my inbox. Of people that subscribed and I know this is not everybody but I just these are the ones that I found and um, I just want to give a shout out and a big thank you to everybody I know I probably need to do this in a separate video but I'm gonna do it now and then I'll do it again later you know on in the week maybe Monday um, to see if anybody else subscribes so I want to say welcome to my channel everybody welcome to my family welcome to um, whatever you want to call it, y'all. Um, my life. The day in the life of me. Little old me, Risa. And, um, the first one is 2003 Bryant. Um, Martinique. I think Wilkes. Or Wix, something like that. Oh, I can't pronounce this. Uh, it's M A M I T A N A I L S. Yeah. Mommy to nails. Hi, um, Beauty blessed doll. Saw twelve. What is that? W L M S. Not quite sure how to say that. Maria Daniels J. Peggy Sawadago. Hold on a minute, I'm coming. Um, Rolandia Player. Mary Jane Baby. Diana K. Love to Be Beautiful. Um, and T Chanel. Um, thank you guys. Thank you guys for watching. Um, I love you guys. Thank you for coming and joining me on my channel. And um, I just send a big shout out and a big thank you. And I send y'all love, peace, and blue Duchess hair grease. I got to call y'all. I'm going to take it and I'll be back to talk to you guys later. Bye, sugar.